My name is Julie Lawton. I'm the head of school at Beijing City International School. We're right in the heart of the city of Beijing in China. So we are surrounded by history and culture and people, and it's really exciting place to be. Our students are not just passive learners, they're active learners. I think that's the key here at BCIS. We have so many students that are innovative, creative, that want to take action, that really believe in our mission. And so we give them the, the resources, the room to grow in these areas and to help BCIS be a better place. If they start with us at the ECC, it's a very hands-on, play-based programme there, which we know research tells us is the best way for students to learn. It is the years where the children are being exposed and introduced to education. And they really need to feel comfortable and safe to be able to dive deeper into their own learning and their own knowing. The idea is to be able to uh, respond to children's needs as and when they happen. So if we see that there's a child who has so much energy right in the morning, we don't have to wait for, the, for that PE lesson to happen. Any teacher can actually take charge and say, you know what, I'll take these five children to the PE right now. Teachers are putting a lot of thought to develop very specific provocations for the students to go and investigate and to go play with literacy being embedded, math skills being embedded, music, art, the sciences, whatever it may be. Through play, it is absorbed and it sticks with them. And then when they get to be older and move into elementary school, those experiences allow them to then go deeper into their learning. When our students come to us from the ECC, they still learn through play-based learning and as they go further up through the elementary school, this becomes slightly more formal. They are encouraged at this time to follow their own curiosity, their own passions, to develop their own understanding. Each child is supported to personalise the way in which they're learning and this is done through teacher guidance, this is done through student questioning, this is done through peer work, this is done through group works. All the teachers are really into child development and you can feel that when they're talking to you about your kids and you're talking together, they understand their personalities and they want to make sure that they're feeling like they fit in the classroom. Every kid is met at their level and then they're pushed and that's really exciting. When our students leave the elementary school, we see students that are empowered to learn, that are inspired to learn and to carry on being lifelong learners. Really what we're about in the secondary school is allowing our students to make choices for themselves about you know, where they want to go with their futures. There are different pathways for students to graduate from BCIS. They can choose the well-known IB diploma and they can also choose our in-house diploma which is called ID8 which is very, very special, very personalised um, and still very well recognised by universities. We're not really preparing students just for the next step of university, but we're preparing students for life beyond university and success in the workplace. The academics are highly valued here and it's a strong emphasis of the school. One of the things that's really beautiful about this place is the physical side of the child's development is equally valued and, and equally supported. So the resources that we have here for the development of our kids, as you can see, they're just fantastic. And the value that's placed on physical activity and learning through movement right across our whole school, right from the early childhood centre right through the elementary school and the secondary school is second to none. Students are challenged at BCIS. It's either through the choices they make and our response to them, it's through our curriculum outcomes, it's through our pathways, it's through our fantastic environment that we have for learning here. Whether you're starting your educational journey in ECC, whether you're transitioning to the elementary school or the middle school, or whether you're ready for university, we'll help get you prepared for those next steps.